hello everybody this is jams and we are back with a new game because i had to get a new hard drive for my old game for my old i had to get a new hard drive essentially because the other one crapped out five months after i got this computer isn't that special so we're going to try out a different game i've been meaning to play this one for a long time uh, it's one of my favorite games, is Lord of the Rings The Two Towers. Uh, this came out on pretty much everything back in the day. Decided to play the GameCube version for you guys. The neat thing about this is it integrated the footage from the films into the game in a very unique way, and you'll see what I mean once I hit new game. We'll play on normal. And here we go. Now this, I originally played this on the PlayStation 2, and for some reason my capture software doesn't want to capture PlayStation 2 footage, so we're going to play the GameCube version. I just really hope I don't get copyrighted because I'm, cause this film, because this game uses footage from the film. Oh yeah. Much that once was is lost. For none now live who remember it. It's wonderful to see you, Gandalf. Oh my god. Okay. You might as well get some popcorn, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be here for a bit. Please don't sue me, Tolkien Estate. Please don't sue me, New Line Cinema and Time Warner. Please don't sue me, Peter Jackson and Wedded Workshop. Because I'm just trying to show the nice people this wonderful game that I played back in the day. It's interesting, though, because it says it's two towers on the box, but it... At least half of the levels are from the Fellowship of the Ring. There's reason for that, and I might get into that in a later video, but, you know. Into this ring, he poured his cruelty, his malice, and his will to dominate all life. One ring to rule them all. It's almost as if I've seen this movie before. And by before, I mean like a hundred fucking times. Man, I saw this when I was like 10 years old, 10, 11 years old, was a little too young to see this, and I thought it was the coolest shit, even though it gave me nightmares. Yeah, this film gave me nightmares, if you can believe that. Apparently they wanted to get Hugo Weep. Apparently they wanted to get, uh, yeah, this bit blew my mind when I was a kid, just transitions into the game graphics. All right. As I was saying, they were originally apparently wanted to get David Bowie to do the part of Elrond, but he turned it down, I guess, or he wasn't available. So they went with Hugo Weaving instead. Fuck you, get in the... Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, they're stuck. Hey guys, you gonna come out here? Wanted to just lure this... Oh, for God. Just damn it. I wanted to show you what... Because you can kick these guys in the lava, and I wanted to show you that. Now, just let me kick you. Into the lava. There we go. Oh, 
Yeah, this uh, Isildur Swift Terror is going to be your best friend in this game. For the White City! Listen here, you little shit. So you got this combo system that you can just die! Probably just gonna get a good rating on this, isn't it? It's just unfortunate. But we were winning until we weren't. If you like this well enough, I'll do Return of the King. His Return of the King I thought was even better than this game because it had co-op, but I'm by myself right now, so I don't really have anybody to play with. But he didn't! Now this scene in the film is like different from the book. They never actually go up to the Mount Mount Doom in the book that way. So the whole thing of Elrond pushing him off was it couldn't happen. All right. So you get ranked at the end of each mission, depending on how well you did, and all of that. Yeah, good rating. Uh, it's not safe for now. Do apologize, by the way, if my webcam overlay is not able to be seen. So, you, well, not my webcam overlay. I think it might be obscuring the health bar, but rest assured, I'm probably not going to lose. I've been playing this game since I was like 12. So, these guys used to kick my ass, but now they're pretty easy. Because... They're not exactly immune to... Fuck you! Fuck you! Frodo! Keep away from them! No! They're everywhere! Where are you, you little bastard? Aw, oh, damn it. Come here. When I was testing this, I did manage to get a perfect rating. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like that's going to happen, but it might still, as long as I don't screw it up. I like, I perfected them all, and it was awesome. Fuck 
you! Oh shit, I think I just skipped the cutscene. Oh well. Anyway, the fellowship forms and all of that. So... Now this is the neat thing. You can get EXP and stuff to buy new moves. First one we're gonna go after is a sealed or swift terror. That is the one that you want the most to start with. And we're not gonna save just yet, but then you get all this behind the scenes information about the game and the films, and then you get to play as Aragorn, Legolas, or Gimli. We're gonna play as Aragorn, I think, because he's the guy that I have the most experience with. But uh, for now, I think that's going to be a video. So in the next one, we are going to approach Moria. So 